Hey, my scrubs, welcome to the class of 09. There it is. I didn't have the logo out right there. <laughs> I'm gonna warn you right now. This is a wild game. And apparently, uh, its whole thing is it's supposed to be making fun of visual novels. So like, you know how like anime visual novels, it's always like usually like a guy meets like a million girls. They all fall in love with him. He creates this like, <laughs> you know, crazy thing. Well, this is supposed to be like the completely opposite of all of that. And it's supposed to be super funny. And I've been seeing this game around. You guys, I've, some comments have been suggesting that I play it. And I see that it's uh, been rising up in popularity. So let's just start this right together, shall we? If you guys want to see more, make sure you hit that like button. Let's do it. Make no mistake. I'm a sociopath. Oh God. God, that sounded evil. Let's rewind a little. I grew up so you, all you're over a YouTuber. coastal America. House after house after restraining order, everything just kind of blends in. If the divorce rate is 50-50, my mom landed on tails like eight times. So by the time I was 14, Aww. right? I moved from seven different houses and attended six different this, this school districts. This game's a joke, by the way. I'm just After saying, a while, that's why I'm you saying that. The point in making friends. The vitamin C graduation song? Yeah, I can't relate. But then one year, all of that almost changed. For the first time ever, I when found myself Nation in a attacked? school for two consecutive years, going on three. And then I like started turning pretty a month into high school, so the guys hitting on you social leverage was really awesome. The popular girls would talk to me all the time. They were just stupid. Like they'd always been pretty. Oh my Never God. left out. Never alone. And when I think about it, all the thinking I've ever done was when I was alone. There she is. I was nice about it and thought I'd always be nice about it. Finally in one place to build a steady reputation. And then life said, fuck that. My piece of shit <laughs> gamer brother got us evicted for pirating breakbeat mixtapes. What? It's like not even good music. Anyway, so mom was crying, packing oh, up the sorry. moving boxes. Ah, and that's when she told stop. me, we're moving ah, out of state. Go back. And I just got settled. I said, fuck you, I'm living with dad. He's just a neighborhood down. I put the boxes down, go over, knock on the door, and boom, a gunshot. My Whoa. second Christmas killed himself. I walked in. Floor looked like a whole ass video game. Just what? blood everywhere. And get this. His <laughs> note was stuck to the fridge with a cookie monster magnet. All he wrote on it, Nicole's fault. What? I'm Nicole, by the way. Hi. What the <laughs> did I do to him? Maybe I missed the office softball game. Men are so into this revenge <laughs> thing. Okay. <But> whatever. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Nothing matters. Hey, we got to uh... I'm moving. Again. City, county, state. All the same fate. But I've always said that. This while is what is the Star Wars? This Jeez, time, give me in the game already. It's on arrival. <laughs> oh my god, well what a start. Um yeah, let's all say a prayer hey, for my so editor Gonzi. Your prank this year? What if we like parked our cars where we don't usually park them? Whoa. Oh my god, that is so funny. <laughs> yeah, math class this year with Mr. Burliday. <laughs> yeah, like Mr. Burliday, dude. <laughs> oh, they are never funny. It's like the girls just laugh to avoid the assault. Oh, hey, wow. yo, you okay. knew this education. Dude, this, <laughs> this is going on its own. I don't wow, even... Yeah, that was funny. Yeah, I'm getting into like humor and stuff. Anyway, you know anyone around here? Know where your classes are? I mean, kind of. Wait, wait, is the game. Do I have to pause the game? Is the game going? <laughs> this is not how uh, visual novels usually are. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Hi. All right. Let's do that. So, so a little more about this game. It's supposed to have the uh, 2000s aesthetic, which is where I grew up. I grew up in the 2000s, obviously. Yeah, dude. Like she's wearing the. Uh, oh, what's that logo? Oh my god. Everyone used to wear that crap. Famous? Is it famous? I can't remember. And I'm telling you, it's, it was it was different. It, it was different uh, growing up in that time, you know. All right. I guess we'll continue. I, I don't know if we get to pause it. Uh, let's just. See what happens, I guess. There's like numbers on the doors. I think I can figure it out. No, 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 no. I, I could show you around. Like like a school tour. Is this you the love interest? You up for that? Oh, um, tell tell him off and cut class, decline and go straight to class. Humor the school. So yeah, we have, oh, <laughs> wait a minute. I just realized it's a sidekick. Oh my God, dude. I never had a sidekick back in school. There was hardly any touchscreen phones. Like back, maybe back in 2010, like I did, I did have a, a touchscreen phone. But it's like, I didn't have a sidekick. Sidekicks were so freaking cool. Cause they like flipped up like a, kind of like a Game Boy. It was so sick. And like they played music. That was revolutionary back then. Phones didn't play music back then. 
Not, not, like, you know, some of them did. And they had, like, no memory. I don't know what route we're going to be taking, but let's just tell them off and cut class. I'm going to be honest. You seem like the most boring piece of shit I ever met. <laughs> huh? Well, wait. Most I've ever met would mean you stand out in some way. You're a very run-of-the-mill waste of time. Wow. I don't get it. what I do? Crispin? You have time for the whole list? I Dang, guess. she's First, so you Nicole, man. First, t-shirts from Walmart. Girls don't compliment how you dress, <laughs> so you settled for old people high-fiving you for being retro. Man, then where did you get? Nah, people think I'm cool. Rapid fire people receptions. Think I'm cool? Tell me if I get any wrong. You call your bicycle a BMX, like energy drinks, you take monsters? pictures of your skateboarding wounds, Monster? mention to anyone they can't get addicted to and own a guitar pick necklace. Oh, uh, he's like, well, <laughs> I'll, right, see uh, I'll, I'll see you later then. I'll see you later then. That's so true. Hey, I've seen your ass around here before. <laughs> it's my first day. You sure about that? Whatever. All you hot girls look the same. That was real discreet. <laughs> Gotta be. Especially cutting under this school security. Uh-huh. We don't even... And a girl like you skipping the first day? Are you bad bitch or what? What? I'm an abysmal bitch. Fucking cool. Rock on. So what do you do so here? Stupid. Like cheerleading? Doesn't pay, so no. Well, I'm on the lacrosse team. Last season, we went seven and five, like above 500, not bad. It's my life, pretty much. How can you make the cross your life? There's no pro league Bro, for like, it. Wait, I, I'm not used to like just not being able to pause. I, I guess the game's just going to go on its own, man. I, I guess I'll just interject and pause it whenever. I don't know. I don't well, even know what lacrosse sure is. I ain't going to lie. Besides, we only lost like five games because I f***ed my knee up and couldn't play the rest of the season. But it's pretty badass because they keep giving me Percocet. Cool. Oh, wow. Seriously? Nice. How much? Enough to demotivate an elephant. <laughs> I got him right here. You want to do him with me? They only kind of get you f***ed up, but it's good. Jeez, dude. All right. No, my high school is not like this. <laughs> uh, I, I can relate to like the, the phone and everything, but no. Ah, why not? I guess. Free I don't freaking Percocet? know. Hell yeah. Hand it over. This is actually my Mexican cartel supply, but it probably won't kill you. <laughs> uh, that's fine then. I'm sure there's nothing my shady in there. feel great. I could fall asleep standing right now. Oh, God. Yeah, I told you it was good shit. I'm sorry, are we lost? We got the teacher. Both of you should be in class. Run. This isn't a skip period. Oh, f uh, hey, dude, we were just on our way, you know? What are you hiding there? Uh, <laughs> prescription <laughs> pills? Who's attacked Who's are these? Actually, it doesn't matter. You're both in big trouble. You screaming, man. Uh, pin it on the other guy. Uh, avoid getting murdered for snitching. Nah, I'm pinning it on the other guy. I don't like him. Wait, wait, what? Oh, don't play dumb. I didn't do anything. I was on my way back from the bathroom, and this guy just stopped me trying to sell his... For second? I don't know what it's um, called. I don't know, but he won't leave me alone. Oh, come on. Trying to find yet another customer, huh, Kyler? <laughs> come with me. It's Bro, like some South Park you're game, seriously man. seriously believing that? I don't want to hear it. Come with me. You're such a fucking bitch, dude. Like, not cool. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Oh, lunchtime. We can play lacrosse? Freaking loser. That was the ultimate win-win. Oh, God. Hey, What's uh, next? I don't even want to know. What? Oh, no, I'm good as shit, dude. I don't feel great. Just nice. Just nice. So is anyone else going to be sitting here or... Oh, sit here all you want. I'm new here. I have no say. Cool, thanks. Um, I'm just going to say it. Are you f***ed up? Are of you? Of course. Emotionally, absolutely. I'm not rich enough to turn down free Percocet. Yeah, that lacrosse guy loves the new girls. Did you pocket any? Can I have one? No, it got broken up real quick. A teacher caught us. Uh, I don't know what route we just him. took. That's Bro, these yeah. are real people in the background. <laughs> Why is this real people? Badass. What's your name? I'm Nicole. But don't say that really loud. I don't want these people to know me. Don't worry. Know I know. Me. So, what electives are you taking? Uh, like, uh, is English no. an elective? No, it's, she it don't even know what an elective be, is. No. Okay, then. It was photography. Me too. We might. Hey, what'd you guys take? Are you are you in high school now? Were you in high school? Whatever. I took law enforcement. I took a few. I took art, law enforcement. I took art because I didn't have to do Spanish. I know, like they were gonna force me to do Spanish, and I didn't want to do it because I heard it sucked. Because they don't even teach you Spanish that you actually like need. So it really, yeah, I wasn't interested in that. So I took art. That was fun. I drew stuff. And then I took law enforcement. Law enforcement was so fun. That our teacher in law enforcement let us do anything. Oh, and I took ceramics because we also, we got to do anything we wanted in that class. So it was like the most chill classes ever. I didn't do anything that she did though. I don't know. No, I say no. In the same class. If you'd like to get that excited about it, yeah, we might be. 
Oh, you're too cold for school? Well, no. Right now I feel warm as hell. Have you popped perk? It's a blanket and a pill. Yeah, I popped perk. How the fuck is it a blanket and a pill? I ain't gonna lie, I don't even know what that is. Sensors. You just feel nice and cozy. You're fun. You're fun. Nicole! Well, this game's going fast, man. Two? I'm not even controlling someone it. someone gonna kill me day two? If so, absolutely. Why? Can't, what happened? Wait, wait, wait. Like, is she wait, is she actually gonna die though? Like I think these routes get really crazy, as you can see already. Nothing general hurts, and I gotta deal with my brother who's still up from the night before eating a family box of anything. He can eat family-sized meals. How old is he? Like twenty-six. He just freeloads off my mom. Oh, I see. I mean, we kind of freeload too, but we're sixteen. It's cool when we do it. Exactly. I have to tell him that when I'm woken up by loud chewing noises. Is he fat? Do you know what ex-bodybuilder fat is? Yeah, I kind of know what that looks like. Well, he's an obese monster. I was just curious if anyone else knew that bodybuilder phrase. He's not that. Good to know. Hey, let's gossip more at lunch. God. I gotta get to class. Dude, for class, just skip with me. I told you yesterday, if I skip anymore, my mom's gonna start giving me disciplinary tattoos. <laughs> what is a discipline? The heck is a disciplinary tattoo? Stay down! I'm gonna tattoo you! I just read one of this. Look at this review. It's literally Fortnite for girls. <laughs> what? I guess a lot of girls play this game. I don't know. My audience is still 50 50%. Like split right down the middle. It used to be higher, uh, sixty percent girls and then guys, and then yeah, it just totally got split down the middle. But like, this just seems like one of those like edgy teen movies back in back in the day. I remember like watching those. Like, How does it even work? What does she write on you? It'd be some weird shit, like I love school on my fingers. Isn't that like <laughs> abusive? I would say it's so. The only mom I've ever had. How the fuck should I know? Huh. That's so fine. <laughs> it's fine, right? Uh, we're going to gym class, I guess. I don't freaking know. Why, why not? Look, it's the first day. No funny guys. No comedians. Do you have a no Mario? Is that like that one okay. Mario? <laughs> this year's gym class isn't last year's gym class. We're going to really buckle down on physical fitness. I'm fit as fuck. I ain't buckling. <laughs> <laughs> Young lady, what's oh, your name? Oh, we got a class clown over here. You know what always like pisses me off? I like, and this happened a lot. Not all, not all of my teachers were like this, but like I thought it was so stupid that like most of the physical education, the PE teachers were not in shape. So like, how can you tell, like, how can you be teaching a PE class? It's about literally physical education, moving, exercising. It's supposed to be healthy, right? And they never were. You're like, they didn't look like they moved a day in their life. Except there there was a few. There was a few that you could tell they actually were in shape. But um, I'm just saying, I just find that uh, awfully ironic. Nicole, you want my phone number too? <laughs> this is only the first class, Nicole. You won't be a problem all year, will you? No, sorry. Good. Sorry. Everybody better dress out every class. If you don't, it's a zero. Hit oh. the locker rooms. <laughs> I'll see you back here in 10. I remember getting in trouble for PE because like, I wouldn't put my PE clothes. Why did, why, why did I get in trouble? I think I got in trouble because uh, I would have my PE clothes like under my clothes when you're supposed to like, change in the locker room or something. Like I didn't want to change in front of people or something. And like, I remember getting in trouble for that. I don't, I don't even remember why. Just didn't like it, man. I don't know, let's ditch because we're a bad kid. I don't know, man. I really don't know. So gym class showing our education so Jeffrey's system the nerd. is pure evil. You can tell by his Why glasses you and his like Mario shirt. What do you mean? If I talked like a cartoon, I'd go, what's up, Doc? <laughs> no, <laughs> that, it's Doc? just this general, ha ha, I'm random cartoon channel talk. Have you ever watched television for adults? What? Do you mean like... No, not no, that. No, just normal. Never mind. Huh, <laughs> because I like some wild <laughs> here and there. You probably couldn't handle it. What the heck? Time for a vicious reality check. Uh... All right, let's do that. <laughs> Who cares? Just stop. For a nerd, you're not too smart socially, huh? Hey, I'm just trying to have fun here, and I'm not a nerd. I'm a geek. There's a difference. Yeah. Sorry, which one grows up to be a and which one grows up to be a Ugh, you and everyone else at this she's school. She's so... I'm sick of she's being so of mean. Of jokes. Dude, whatever. The blatant disrespect, snickering behind my back, fake love notes beating me up. Okay, really didn't need your life story here. Stealing my stuff, egging my house, blackmailing oh me, my calling God. my mom at work and telling her I'm dead. Oh, they wow. Didn't go that hard here? And weak enough to snap right before I get to death. 
I'm sick of all of it. And I guess you want to be on that list too, huh? Let his usual... Wait, wait, wait. God, this game just tackles everything, don't it? Um, all right. We'll let his usual bully take over. Hey, what are you cripples doing? Oh, he's the bully. To cut Sorry. Yourselves with? Wait, 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 wait. Uh, well, actually, this weirdo is just Sorry. spinning on me. Can you believe it? Wow, Jeff. Didn't know you there. liked girls. Who is this that Jeff guy. you speak of? All right. I thought it was probably better for me to move my face down here because it's kind of in the way. Sorry. My face has got to go somewhere. The name's Jeffrey. Thank you. Yeah. See? More of that He's the anime protagonist. He won't stop talking to you or something. Yeah. Make yourself useful and kick his ass for me. Dude. You're not enough to listen to. This, sure. The, the oh, main character no, is so awful. My glasses are brand new. Can't we just read some manga instead? Read <laughs> some manga. Oh, man. I feel terrible. Hey, how you doing? Uh, just coping. Coping with what? Just the power I have as a girl. Did you come here from the feminist seminar? No, Jim. What happened? Like, okay, I pretty much just got the lacrosse kid to beat the shit out of the anime kid. Tell us. <laughs> oh, he's just no he just noticed the anime kid? I guess I technically was, like, the anime kid as well. But, like, it was weird because, like, I was, like a nerd and um i don't know like a good 90 pounds more than i am now back then i really was into anime even back then and everything like that but like and i wasn't a cool kid but at the same time there was another set of people that were really into anime that even i didn't want to have anything to do with and i thought that they were very obnoxious and like i couldn't stand them so like i don't know where i was i definitely wasn't cool but i had friends and i was cool with that i was just you know just i, I just had my my chemical romance playing watched my anime I chilled. It was cool. Wasn't much of a fight, honestly. Oh, did he do the nerd fight thing where he just hugged onto him really tight? Yeah, fine with missing that. Dude, it's not even the fight. Just, like, how I got it to happen. I didn't promise a date or sex or anything, and he just went with it. The way you're processing this is kind of scary, to be honest. She's evil, what, man. You never manipulated someone before? No, I technically do it all the time. I've just never verbalized it like that. <laughs> Are we bad people? Yes. I don't know. I'm still just trying to process why he'd fist fight for someone he barely knows. Because you're pretty. Pretty what? No, you're just really pretty. Her name well, is like Jekka? That pretty? No way. Never heard if of that gonna name. If you're going to be one of those girls who fish for compliments 24-7, I'm going to find someone else to sit with. No, seriously, like, what are they worked up over? <sighs> you're cute, long flowing hair, and... Oh, God. Big. Okay, I was fishing for compliments. You know what? <laughs> I, I, I was fishing for compliments. All right, I'm I'm in the process of trying to figure out where my face should go to where I don't block anything. There, if we do an episode two, I'll I'll I'll, I'll know a good place for my face. See, like, why aren't we consciously using this to our advantage? Using being pretty? It's called <laughs> for women who never had the conversation we're having right now. Dumb bitches who are like, wow, everyone's so helpful. You really think he's nice because he's into me? And that's like half my friends. Oh my God. What? Seems no. like a fever dream, man. And then, and then <laughs> oh no, I'm 26 and ran out of guys hitting me up. Life is so unfair. Well, does anyone really run out of guys? You run out of good ones real quick. Oh yeah. So this new philosophy, unveiled manipulation. How long are you running with it? Till graduation? Till death. They're so, like, meta. Like, they're just breaking the fourth wall. And they are awful months later. <laughs> it's just so, real houses. it's been a few months since we moved. How's school going? <clears throat> like, academically or socially? Everything. Anything. Honestly, it's going pretty good. Oh, that's great to hear. I know moving schools can be hard. And if I cared, it absolutely would be. But mom... I figured out that if you just don't engage with other people's emotions or desires, nothing's a burden. Excuse me? Like, I'll put it like this. Anytime a guy asks for my company, asks me out, asks for anything, and I make decisions entirely for myself, not concerned with their feelings, there's no stress. Basically, I manipulate I, that them. That sounds a little mean-spirited, don't you think? Everybody's yeah, just NPCs. I like how her mom, like, I, it sucks I can't pause the game. Like, I really wish that, I hope that, because there is a sequel from what I've seen, but I really hope you could pause the game without doing this, because this is very annoying. But like, I just wanted to point out that her mom is literally a clone of her. Like, her face is exactly the same, just different hair to colored eyes. Alternative, being used to do shit. People, especially men, are the perfect pawns when you don't give a fuck about them or whatever they want. <sighs> I won't argue. I'll just hope you learn how to interact like a human being when you're a senior. So you're telling me it's a requirement oh, for women to be pushovers or sociopathic? What the fuck? 
happened to feminism, Mom? Nicole, I don't know any woman who actively considers feminism. We vote and work. It's just a fun thing to say. Okay, well, f*** feminism. I'm starting Nicoleism. Nicoleism? Nicoleism. Yeah, the main concept is girls removing all the emotional attachment from anyone. Oh, I'm sure you'll meet a nice boy soon and you'll be all over this. How can I meet a nice boy when all men are just this and Is fucking kids nice, Mom? This conversation is over. What? She, look, I, I know there's a lot of uh, bleeping going on here, but she's freaking wild. She just, she hates all men, apparently. There's Nicoleism. October 2008. And so you see... The aperture actually gets wider the lower the f-stop gets. Oh, there's talking really about cameras here. <clears throat> I wish I would have learned about this. You really this. need that cough like that. It's kind of annoying. This isn't cosmetics class, Nicole. I know that. So pay attention to the photography lecture in photography class. I'll be done in like two seconds. Just calm down. Now, Nicole. Uh... He can't tell you what to do. Now nothing. Literally, go f yourself. <laughs> How dare you? Oh my god, you? so funny. How dare you disrupt my lecture? It's disrespectful to me and your classmates. You can't trick anyone here into being mad at me when no one gives a shit about your class in the first place. Ooh. Well, how would you like a failing grade? How would all of you like a failing grade? What did they do? I mean... I guess it's fine. It's an elective. Yeah, Mr. White, you can't keep us from graduating. You tell him, Nicole. Yeah. Shut the f up, you finger skateboard bitch. <laughs> dude, <I'll> <laughs> she, dude, she's like, <laughs> ain't nobody safe around Nicole. She just tells them all, man. She's so mean. I was just trying to help. Yeah, you were trying something. How would you like a You're visit to the something. counselor's office? The principal's office? Hey, if you think not listening to you talk is discipline, then I'm gone. No problem. Out. <laughs> no. No. Out. Oh, my God, man. Like, if I, I, oh. Some teachers in school, listen, I had a lot of good teachers, and I respected them. But there was just a few of those teachers that literally, like, you could just tell that they hated their job. And they just wanted to make themselves feel bigger by, like, being unfair for no reason. It was so obvious. Even, even as, like, you know. 15, 16, you know, up until I was 18, like, there's just those teachers that were just, like, just completely awful for no reason. And I, if I knew the knowledge that I had right now and I could go back to my younger self, oh, my God, I would tell them. I'd be like, I would just tell them that. I don't even care. I'm not saying you should do that. But I'm just saying, like, but, like, if I knew how my life was going to turn out, I would tell them. But I do not recommend anyone else do that. Because, like I said, I had some good teachers and I loved them. Again, Nicole... Can we just pretend you said a lot of stuff so I can leave early? The principal ordered for you to be in this room for one hour. Well, I order no mayo at Dairy Queen, but you still see them slapping the shit on. It's true. Oh, what do you Actually, mean? Actually, I don't eat at Dairy Queen, but at McDonald's, How are man. You feeling? And I'm saying Subway. if a whole company like them can't get my order right, then what's one guy like you? Mistakes happen. They can try again after the next soccer practice. I think we got a bit sidetracked. She's trying to manipulate here. again. No, not just sidetracked. I fucking derailed this shit. <laughs> talking out of turn in class, bullying classmates, talking back to faculty. Is this really the legacy you want to leave? Apparently. In? Shed some light on everyone else? Uh, it's high school. Who gives a crap? I'm sorry, legacy? Yes, your mark, your impact left on the student body. Graduation's only a few months away, you know. See, I'm glad you brought that up. I will literally never see any of these people again after graduation. There's no point in socially trying with anyone here. You must have someone you'd like to stay in touch with after graduation. Nope. Not even your friend Jessica? Jessica's like, okay, but I'm not going out of my way to hang out with her. Isn't legacy for like a major career or something? Your high school career. Oh, is this a career now? What's my salary? A $2 lunch and 20 years of <laughs> harassment trauma? Such pessimism at such what? a young age. When what? you're an adult, you learn how to I don't know if I follow. Life. Oh, I'm sure there's tons of life to love. None of it having anything to do with this high school. Why would I care what some kid sitting two rows back from me thinks? It's not about right now. It's the tons of fun memories you can revel in years after college. Okay, um, I know well, you like work here and employee <laughs> culture keeps your checks signed, but... Anyone well into their 20s still thinking about how high school was is a fucking waste of space. Perhaps I should introduce- Hey, that's not true, though. I- I, I actually did enjoy some of my high school, alright? I mean, I didn't go to college, but, like, 
I don't know. I had a lot of fun times with friends. Again, I wasn't popular or anything, but hey, it was still fun. I thought. I wish I, like I said, I wish I could go back with the knowledge that I have now. Man, oh my God, I would act so much different. I, I, yeah, it would, I would not be taking things so seriously. Introduce you to some of our class of 87 alumni. Many of them are teachers here today. So they're the lower middle class of 87? No thanks. Yeah, she's just, there's no stopping her. Oh, she's, yeah, pretty I guess much. she's. She's an emo now, or Mr. what? White What's going on? Class is so goddamn important. We can take pictures with a camera phone. Who even needs a camera camera anymore? Exactly. Men who teach electives get so insecure when they realize Dude, the they cameras can't stop anyone from back then, though. They were so Bitch, bad. Happy anyone even took your class. It's an art course anyway. Like doing your makeup's a huge step down. What's up, you whores? <laughs> wow. Hi, Kyler. You should talk in Mr. White. Yeah, he probably deserves it. What do you want? All right, damn. Did you guys get an invite to Kelly's pool party? It's October. No, her parents are like really rich. It's glass thin and everything. Yeah, and her pool stuff is sick. They got those four foot long syringe water gun things. What are you, 10? Whatever. Just a little fun on the side while we'll picking up bitches. I've been here for a year and <laughs> Yo, never once heard so of someone cool. having sex with you. I've been here since third grade and haven't heard it. Nuh-uh. Remember freshman year with Jenny Fillmore? She was unconscious. How do you still brag about that? You're like the reason they have women's college. Okay, old news, whatever. You have invites or not? Yeah. Yeah, this Me is too. very stereotypical, you man. One? You haven't even been here that long. Because I have a nice face and I'm not fat. Okay, well, can I tag along with you guys? This weekend's gonna be so boring if I can't go. I don't want to be responsible for you ruining the party, but I also don't want to be responsible for you crashing it out of roid rage. Nicole's choice. Yeah, he looks Fine. like he's on roids Nicole, for sure. I know I called you a whore like two minutes ago, but could you let me go with <laughs> you just this once? Uh, I don't hang out with... Yeah. No, f*** off. Fine, be a bitch. See if I care. <laughs> You're just mad you can't see us in bikinis this weekend. What are you doing? What? Don't get flustered like the that. The kitties. A... Turns into violence overnight for those types. What, like choking and biting? That and f***ing off while thinking about us suddenly okay. turning into Jekka would look so hot with her organs gouged out. Okay. How do you know these things? This is, I had dude, a brother. I don't even know if you guys don't even know what's going on with half this stuff. I got a freaking, that my, my poor editor has to edit out. They, they really hit the nail on the head with those freaking teen movies, man. That's like all this is just completely wild, man. So what are you wearing to Kelly's pool party? Well, summer's over, so no more selling anything. Hello, girls. Going to a pool Oh, God, party not the weird-looking counselor fall? again. Yeah, well, I don't know. Maybe. I can't find anything to wear for it. I could help you out with that. You sell bikinis? Of course not. But swing yeah. by Dude, my I office knew he was later weird. and we can take some measurements for the Home Ex Sewing Club. We'll make sure it fits flawlessly no. to your every curve. Call Gee, Dude, where's I'll Chris Hansen? There, Have a good day at school. Did he just say your every curve? <laughs> yeah, is he allowed to say that? What are you guys freaking out about? Oh no, I she's gonna have a field day. I think the counselor might have made an advance at me. He literally asked you to go to his office, get naked, and be measured. Yawn, what else is new? What? You've gone here longer than me. How did you not notice? To be fair, he's kind of subtle about it. He's what I call a marathon Yeah, man, you need to freaking call the cr you got to call Chris Hansen right away. He tries to make you question society's hatred of before he actually makes you. Then you'll feel bad if you tell on him afterward. So he guilts you so he can make a routine out of it? Exactly. A predator that plays the long game. A marathon That's like three levels worse than what I thought he was going to do. Why do you even want to measure you anyway? For a bikini to wear at Kelly's pool party, he'd have Home Eck make it. Home Eck? What are they gonna make? A fucking felt bathing suit? I didn't say I was gonna do it. But yeah, I'd probably fall apart after a lap in the pool anyway. Excuse me? You planned on swimming at a pool party? What do you do at a pool party? Sit around and look cute. Same. Same. God damn it! Why are they still using combination locks? The school's soft. No one steals shit anyway. You still aren't dressed? Yeah, they need thumbprint scanners or some shit. It's 2008, isn't it the future by now? You're gonna be late. No shit. Now, how many spins again? Nailed it! What the f oh, how did you get no. in here? Uh, uh, he's not really making it. The anime, <laughs> the anime kid's really not helping Don't his lock case on here. The doors. Saw it as a great opportunity for an A plus in street photography. Did your cartoons tell you to do this? <laughs> anime? Why didn't anime tell you to screenshot a cam girl in public or something? Oh, Nicole, if your brain was as big as your ample. <laughs> 
then maybe you'd understand. Oh, so I'm sorry, funny. do you think you're cool right now? You're a freak. <laughs> Not even the fiend counselor wants to fuck you. Your petty oh insults God, make the development of this photograph wild, all man. the more satisfying. Oh, Cam girls are all cheap digital nonsense. I've captured your succulent figure on medium format film. Medium Every format little shadow film. and highlight of your tantalizing midriff captured the- Hey, if he was a real anime fan, he would say he prefers uh, a 2D over 3D. That's what a real anime fan would say. He's a fake anime fan. Way was meant to be. If you're gonna harass me, could you not talk like a cartoon character while you do it? I do what I want with my words. I'll also do as I please with this photo. No, come on, just throw the film out. I'm afraid I can't do that. Every boy with a crush on you should pay top dollar for these prints. Or maybe I could hang a giant poster of it out front, humiliating you the way you've humiliated oh, is this me his revenge? time after time. I don't feel bad what? now that we got the guy to beat him up though. Chemistry last year? Kate, sorry, now throw it out. You won't convince me otherwise. Huh. Wait, was I at the wrong locker? This game's this game too wild, man. Oh, I, like I I don't it just really keeps going. I don't know. Thanks hindsight. So what the f do I do right now? This is gonna ruin my life. Why can't you tell the principal again? Cause that's fucking embarrassing. Miss Lynn, that mean boy has a picture of my halfway out. Yeah, they'll probably find a way to make it your fault anyway. I still can't believe he shot it on medium format film of all things. What kind of pretentious <laughs> to film prints? Her parents in the 70s? Wait, like film film? Like it needs to be developed? Yeah, he said he was getting it developed at tomorrow's film club. Break That's in that a DSLR, no right? Lab, I don't no think it works that way. If it's some weird format, there won't be another one for miles and miles, right? Destroying the dark room. Would I get expelled for that? If you go in after everybody leaves, no one needs to know. Just wear gloves or something so you don't leave oh, fingerprints. Gonna, it's gonna be a sneaking gloves? mission, huh? If I have any, will you go with me? No, it's not my ass on film. Come on, I'd help if it was you. <laughs> no, you wouldn't. Uh, okay, I wouldn't, but... God damn it. Is it really the it's end true, of the world if people see you in your underwear? You look good naked. Yeah, exactly. If I had weird <laughs> in a gut, it'd be classified as an artistic nude. But if you're hot with no clothes on... It's... <laughs> Fine, I'll drive you over there, but I'm not stepping a foot inside that place. Let's go. They just slide away. Wow, I, I don't am know what this freaking game reminds me of. It's like a mixture of South Park and like teen movies. Like I don't know. Comes to destroying things. Are you done yet? Yeah, just about. This should buy me enough time to swipe Jeffrey's camera and ruin the negatives. Hey, do you have permission to be here? Cop, it's uh, cop. If I said a teacher told me to meet here for a date, would you go after him or just blame me for that too? A date in your pajamas. Did he tell you to destroy thousands in school property too? Look at this place. Come with me. What? It was like this when I sleepwalked in here. Oh, good excuse. You wear gloves to bed? Yes. Well, so much for Jekka's stupid fucking glove idea. To this day, I genuinely believe sleepwalking would have worked if it wasn't for wearing those. Anyway, I got statewide expulsion. Yeah, this I didn't an know indie? thing either. Mom refused to move again, forced me to get a shit job, and hits me to relieve her She's feelings. She's working at Burger King! The deep fryer leaving craters on my face is bad, but anyone from school seeing me is a <laughs> experience. Wow, the camera really does add 10 pounds. Fuck off. Oh, rip. She worked at Burger King. Hey, there's nothing. Wait, did I? Oh, I got a new message. What does that mean? Thought you were done after one ending, not by a long shot. So that was the Burger King ending. All right. Explore every fate of Nicola's and you just might see things her way or one... Or you're some loser who gets a trigger response when talking to women. Kind of crazier than I thought it was going to be. So, okay. So I think there's 15 endings and we just got one. Well, that was really fast. But yeah, uh, let me know if you want me to play more. Hopefully it passes on the YouTube thing. I I, I, I don't know, man. It's, it, it's funny, but it's like... It's just wild, man. I like how the option down here just says go outside. Do you want to know what happens with Nicole next? We'll find out if you guys smash like and want to see episode two. Today's scrub of the day goes to... Jay Dudified.